A local filmmaker is tackling a timely topic. He's working on a short film that addresses some of the realities in this country due to COVID-19. And the film's being shot right in Reading. WFMD's Caitlin Reardon has that story. There are going to be some shots that are going to be taken uh, probably in the kitchen and in a couple of the rooms. Yeah. Uh, but the, the bulk of it is going to be coming in and, and all, all here. Local filmmaker Robert J. Morgallo got the idea for his short film and wrote the script while in quarantine. I saw something in the, uh, in the news about someone who said that it's perfectly acceptable to lose a few hundred thousand lives in order to open up the economy. He penned a script exploring the dynamics between economic interest and public health in a post-COVID 19 world. It draws the, the, the viewer into question and to look at the arguments on both sides, but then are left with their own interpretation at the end. Wanting to keep things local, Morgallo chose the Gables at the Sterling Guest Hotel as the location for filming. Film tourism here. Uh, you know, if people's like, oh, this film was filmed in this house. Sterling owner Cesar Gonzalez says the script hit home. Do I look for the economic benefit of just accepting whoever wants to have a wedding here, even though, you know, maybe not safe for my family or for my staff. Morgallo says he wrote the script in a way to not just fit the narrative, but also to incorporate the realities of production. We're going to shoot in ways that are uh, uh, social distance friendly, uh, angles, uh, spacing, etc., so that no one is any in any direct contact with each other. The small, mostly local cast and crew will wear masks, use sanitizer, and follow other safety guidelines during production. Both Morgallo and Gonzalez share a passion for inspiring others and providing opportunity, especially to the community. We're hoping that the film industry would be an entry to showcase spreading again. Caitlin Reardon, 69 News.